Okay, guys. When you're becoming a vampire, don't talk to this guy. Because if you talk to him, he will kill you and you'll have to go through all the 20 minutes again before you become a vampire. So screw you. You got... We're gonna kill him, guys. Okay guys, I have no idea how long it's been, but I'm still not a vampire. Hold it on, like, no, I still got this, like, what do I gotta do, man? Okay guys, well, I'm not a vampire yet, and I swear God, it's been well over 20 minutes, so I'm gonna show you some a different mod. First we got a uh, security mod. Oh, we also have Mr. Crayfish's uh, furniture mod. So yeah. Uh, don't mind how there's blood. We got a security uh, password protected chest. Um, don't tell anyone. One, two, three, four. And then, that brings us into the next mod. Storm, the Marvel mod. But I'm also gonna show you a security camera. So yeah, mm -hmm. I can zoom in, zoom out, enable night vision, you know, a ton of stuff. Okay, so, use WASD to go up. Hello. Press shift to edge in that. So I can throw this and cast thunder. Or I can do like 13 attack damage while punching. Oh, camera gone. And we also got lasers here. That's cool. Might lag a bit. I mean, of course, it's gonna lag. There's mods installed into. Um, yeah, we just got a whole bunch of more weapons. I. Um, let's see what. Okay, we got fake lava and fake water. Key cards, you know. There's crayfish furniture mod. Um, we're gonna let's check out the Iron Man Marvel costumes. So that's like. Let's go Ant-Man, maybe? We're gonna go to upgrade the Ant-Man. Sorry if you hear Discord. Um, boom, 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 boom. Off, okay. Um, okay, so guys, I have a slight problem. I don't know how to use these. What the fuck is that? C, maybe? Maybe it's C, C, V. Hmm. Well, um, I think I'm stuck with these. Oh, because I haven't taken off the arm, now. I'm stupid. Okay, so, uh, 
Let's see. We got the. Anti serum? I don't know what that is. I need the Mark 47 I need the Mark 47 Wait one star Mark 40, 40, 47 Anywhere Um Mark 5 CV I don't want these glasses. Uh. Oh my god. Wait a minute. Guys, guys, we're a vampire. We're actually a vampire. Look at my face. <laughs> okay, so. Um. Okay. So, as you can see, we have a blood bar instead of food. We have etched to health. And we have this. Or we don't gotta do that. We can just press P. Then we go to these other things. So, what you're gonna need to upgrade? Oh no, that's <laughs> the sun. Watch, you know, the sun doesn't hurt you unless you're level 3 plus. So, we're good. But, we're gonna give ourselves. Hold on. Then. Pison. Coffin. Yeah, guys. A coffin. Take this coffin, then we sleep in it. And we can only sleep in it during the day, and boom. It's night. Okay, so we got this when we hold R, or you can change the tab or whatever you want. And we got this. So what we're gonna need to level up is get the okay so we're gonna go over here so we're gonna get the altar of inspiration and this is how you craft it guys this is how you craft it one glass bottle three iron ingots and any colored glass but we're just gonna spawn it in so All to of inspiration. So then place this down, and then we go all the way back. We get a bunch of blood bottles, <laughs> and then we, f and then. 
um, we find an innocent little pig, then we hold V. Nom. We get an advancement for that. Okay, you can either kill them or turn them to a pig vamp. See, we just filled this up. So if we just get a ton of pins in here, and suck the blood. Nom. So we're just gonna yummy on that blood. But since we have creative mode, we can just. But you just gotta keep filling this up with blood. So when you do fill it up with blood. You right click with your hand, then it'll take some blood and watch. It'll strike lightning and boom, you're level 2. And then you press P, go to your skill screen, then you have one skill point. Upgrade that with night vision. Let's go! And then regeneration, you can turn into a bat. So we're gonna try to turn into a bat. So we're gonna. Just fill this up a ton. Do that. Level up. And we're gonna do that. And then we're gonna level up again. Okay. So. Get regeneration and bat mode. Then you hold R. Turn into a bat. Sometimes the flying can glitch, so you have to like jump and then turn into a bat to fly. You do take fall damage, just remind it. Um, and then I'm sorry that I'm cheating with creative features. I want to show you guys what it's like to level up. Oh yeah, I forgot. Okay, guys, when you are level four, you cannot use the altar anymore. You have to use altar of infusion so we're gonna switch that up all we do altar of infusion and also give it up some blood bottles we're gonna get the altar tip and then the altar pillar and once you get this you place the altar of infusion go one two three and then place these three blocks up. So one, two, three. Boom, boom, boom. One, two, three. Okay. One, two, three. Okay. Then we add a pillow tip to each of these. And then you get some stone bricks. So I'm gonna just fill these pillars in with these. And once you hold on, once you get all the pillars filled. You go into survival if you did in creative. And then when you right click this, you need pure, pure blood, five human hearts, and a vampire book. Good thing we have commands. So that means we can do give at s van And then we're gonna do Here, blood, and then we're gonna do four the mats, and then we're gonna put that in there. And then we're gonna do human heart five, so we put that in there, and that, and then we do 
Lim Pyre underscore book. You can okay. You can get human hearts from going to a vampire uh, forest and killing all the like bosses. No, you can get human hearts from killing um, hunt vampire hunters. You can get pure blood from killing vampire bosses, and you get the vampire book. I think you can craft it. I'm not sure. I think you get it from killing vampires. I don't know. You can, I think you can find it in villages too. And then once you do that, you escape and then right click. And it'll give you resistance. And then you won't be able to jump as much. You won't be able to walk as much. And then it'll do this. Then strike you. Then your whole screen will turn red. You won't be able to see anything for a second. And then blood cult now we're level five so you can go to these things i would not recommend this because you can just craft an umbrella um but i would recommend range since in rage mode you are much faster and deal more damage but consume more blood so that's exactly what I'm gonna get. There's also a uh, thing, disguise, temporary disguise as a non-vampire to trick mobs and players. And there's also invisibility somewhere right here. There's also freeze, you know, normal stuff like that. So, stretcher is wrong for the ritual when it says that. You gotta take out all these stone things. And then you gotta get some gold blocks. And once you get gold blocks, you gotta not do that. You gotta fill in very carefully. The sun is up, so I'm gonna sleep in my coffin. And by the way, in the chat, it'll turn your name purple because you're a vampire. That means. If you play on a server where it has this mod and you're a vampire and there's vampire hunters on the server, they will know that you are a vampire, so they will kill you. <laughs> they will at least try, unless you're a really powerful vampire. Okay. And then, boom, we got this. Pure blood won't disappear yet. It will disappear soon. But, watch this. We're gonna get the things again. We're gonna get vampire book we don't need to get the pure blood we just got to I think you need 10 this time I'm not sure though boom boom and then and then turns out boom and then I run the ritual again so guys I have a question for you guys leave in the comments if the comments are turned on do you want me to make a server and add this mod into it so you Vampire Hunters vs. Vampires. You want me to add this mod or any other mod to the server? I will do it. For you guys. And then, skill screen. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I'll get this. Well, anyway, guys, uh, that. That's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. Bye.